You're the blasted mechanism in power where you are going Right guys, we have unboxing of Tantra Oud, which is our last release of 2020. So I've planned it back. Uh, we were planning to make something cl close to Oud for Greatness, which we scrapped it later. This is the whole artwork. Let me tell you what's the inspiration. So you see a Om logo and you see the Tibetan chants here, uh, which you normally see in Tibetan different color flags. So this is the whole chanting uh, written here, perfumologist in Hindi. Uh, Tantra Oud, but the irony is this is you won't get the really skanky Oud in this one It's more of a white Oud, which is a transparent Oud, which is Added to it to give a very mysterious character. So what is let's unbox it. This is the whole list of ingredients everything standard to project all the natives Let's open the packaging the entire thing is made in UAE This is how it looks. It's like nicely neatly done gold foiling uh, the mandla design with ohm engraved and nicely smooth box this time. The first few boxes had some issue, but now they've done improved it. It's the bottle. It's the whole artwork. It's more inspired by the Indian elements in it. Even the scent is what is inspired from Ladakh. So now, how does this smell like? Let me tell you. First thing I cleared out, it's not a uh, oud fragrance. One thing. Second thing. It's a fruity fragrance. So it's fruits, frankincense, along with some burnt cotton candy vibe. So it really won't give you that wood for greatness vibe. The reason being there are so many cheap clones available out there, Latafa, Paris Con, and after that I decided to make it a little different. At the same time, I was working on one fragrance called Holy Fuck during the uh, March. Holy time, H-O-L-I, it's the Indian festival. So for that, I was working around with a lot of fruit. So what I've done in this one to give that burnt camping sort of vibe, I've added a lot of fruitiness, comes with camping smokiness, slight woodiness to it, and white musk and white wood. Why I've added white musk and white wood? Because these two properties have been known to change facets with time. These guys, are, uh, these two things have like really great transitions. That's what makes the blend. So this is more of a fruity and free frank, uh, frankincense scent. But then with time, for four or five hours, I get this nice fruity incense vibe. After on dry down, I get this uh, white musk, which stays for like good three, four hours. So overall, I've made it like more of my blends are 30 35 percent pretty strong 8 to 10 hours This one is around 7 8 hours on the top because the notes we have used are more of a transparent notes They do stay but you would feel very ensomic to it because of white mask They are called white mask because they are very transparent It's called white tooth because it doesn't really smell like oud But it's one variant of oud which gives you that nice muskiness If I have to define it I would say it's uh Fruity musky fragrance with white oud. The oud is more of a misnomer here because at last moment I had to change the blend and uh, I really didn't want to do a clone on this, particularly on this spiritual design. I didn't want it to do a clone. For that reason, I have to do some last minute editing on the formula part as well. But I'm happy with the whole thing. Apart from one defect that it says oud, so it creates a very different... Uh, expectation that they'll be uh, smelling something like my older creations like Berong de Bali, like nocturnal oud, people would expect that but that's not the case here. Just when you're smelling even a sample or a bottle, first thing a bottle is a collectible here. Nobody uh, just before this I've shot a video for clones and look at this bottle. So it's it's a different level altogether. For that reason I didn't put a inspiring oil in this one rather than trying to do something on my own. So it gives, gives you nice 3-4 feet of aura around you. Fruity, uplifting, uh, you will you will, like feel uplifted. It's like one of the most calming scents. Like it's all about peace, Om, the whole mantra. So it's very calm, calming scent. And do not expect oud, white oud, white musk. Yes, that will show you the facets of all the fruit, fruitiness and the frankincense we have used in here. So Tantra Oud by Perfumologist. This was just the unboxing video of it. I would be probably doing another shoot, proper shoot for this one. Alright guys, Tantra Oud available on perfumery.co.in and perfumologist.com for international. 
again it's going for 49.99 and for this presentation in a great scent it's more designed for uh, overall audience people some people who find my scent really strong even those people would love this yeah some people who really like like instant vintage of course this will last you like half the instant vintage because instant vintage is like enormous tatwa is enormous this would give you like what others other fruity scents give you check it out see ya